Charles Dickens in his Tale of Two Cities opened the book with, it was the best of times, it was the worst of times. And 200 years later, it's the best time ever, it's the worst time ever. It's both. The public is ill. They're overweight and they're ill. Over the age of 30, almost everybody in this country is sick. Two thirds of the people are overweight. Well over 30% are on medication over the age of 30. And about half have risk factors like high cholesterol, high blood pressure, high blood sugar that predict that they're gonna have a less than ideal life. We have a, a classification called morbid obesity. They're now coming up with one called morbidly morbid obesity. We're getting fat. We are the fattest people in the history of the world. And we're getting fatter. My father was a police officer. It was just something that he, he kind of wanted me to do. Right after the first two years on the job, um, I guess I kind of let my guard down. And I got up to 215 pounds. I was heavy. My whole life I had, I had followed your uh, powdered muscle drinks and thinking that that was, you know, what I should be eating, you know what I mean? And, you know, the, the side of the, you know, you get a tub this big and the side of it, the ingredients are like this and, you know, you don't even know what's in there. It looks like the same ingredients that are in like something you'd find underneath your, your kitchen sink. The biggest obstacle I think right now to the average person that wants to get healthy is that it's been portrayed as something that's very complex that you have to be really well educated to understand or to follow and that it's expensive um, and that uh, you know it requires the the use of extensive supplements or these so-called magic potions and in fact it's the simplest thing we could ever follow. I thank my lucky stars that whatever it is that came into my life made me try this because it's the best thing I have in my life is, is the way I eat. And I'm not telling you that I'm right. I don't know if I'm right. I can tell you how I feel. Um, but what I find out that everybody else goes on is just what they've been told all their life. If you could eat the way I eat for a month, if I could just force you to eat the way I eat for a month, you'd never eat anyway again. <laughs>